Hi guys, welcome back. So this is my morning routine with a teacup, pomery, and puppy. Mia is being crate trained, so she sleeps in her crate at night, and in the morning she cuddles for a little bit, but I'm awake watching her. Then I go wash my face, and I bring her with, and I do watch her closely while she's up on this thing. Otherwise, she can go run around and potty before I put her on the potty pad. But while I'm brushing my teeth, she'll be up there. But I'm basically just washing my teeth, washing my teeth, brushing my teeth, and then I'm washing my face with cold water and a light cleanser. I don't do anything super heavy for skincare in the morning, especially before a workout. Um, but I still like to use a gentle cleanser and I like to use cold water in order for my face to kind of be shocked and wake up really quickly. I'll also then pop in my contacts. I have daily contacts, so I'll just put those in so I can... Then I'm using a toner and I'm using these like capsules from my uh, dermatologist, but basically I'm supposed to use a cloth and rub my face with the witch hazel mixed with the product. Then I'm using this Bosha coconut water moisturizer. It's a really light. It's like the perfect moisturizer if you need something to put on before you work out or if you uh, don't really feel like you want anything heavy on your skin. Then I use an eye gel. This is the Dermalogica Stress Positive Eye Gel. The little head is cooling. I like it. It's very lightweight, um, but I find it helps depuff your eyes or if they're dry, it kind of helps brighten them up. I also put on a little bit of chapstick. My lips are usually dry from the night before. This is a really light chapstick. I find it's like very hydrating, but it's not oily or heavy or something that I'd leave on overnight. Then I roll my face, and this is just a Nurse Jamie roller, and I just roll my face out. I sometimes do cupping, and then Mia plays with me while I do it, but I really like to do this. I find it honestly really does help me depuff my face. Mm -hmm. Then we go and play for a little bit. She has lots of toys. She has this ice cream toy that she loves. A lot of you guys on Instagram know this is her favorite toy. If she's obsessed with it, if you touch it and she sees you, she will attack you. Uh, but I like to play with her for a little bit because she's super energetic. She'll play with me for a little bit and then she'll chase Coco around for the next half hour or so. But I like to get some of her energy out because she doesn't have all of her shots yet. So I can't take her for walks. Otherwise, um, I would take her for a morning walk. And when she does have them, we'll be able to go for a morning walk around this time. <laughs> Once again, the ice cream toy, great hit, loves it. She also has like this chewy bone that tastes like chicken. She's not the biggest fan, she's more of like a plush girl. I also will feed her. She's eating right now Blue Buffalo's brand of puppy food. If you guys have any other puppy food recommendations for small puppies, let me know. She's not the biggest fan of this, so I'm looking for something else to substitute it with. So if you guys have had any pups or have a pup and you have a food that they love that's really uh, clean and healthy for them, let me know. This is her crate. My sweaters are in it because it calms her down at night uh, to have the set on there, but she'll go eat in the crate. Then I will go make my morning matcha while she's eating really quickly. So I'm just using this tea kettle. I got off of Amazon, I'll get a lot of questions. Here's Coco and Mia, light interaction. Um, they're, they're friends now, so don't worry. In the beginning, Coco was a little bit overwhelmed, but now they hang out, they lie together, they nap together, and they play together. So it's super cute. I'm just making my morning matcha. I really like this because coffee for me first thing in the morning honestly makes me very anxious. I almost get like panicky and it just it doesn't make me feel good. The matcha I find gives me a boost of energy. I love the taste of it. It's really calming for me to make and I just sit and drink it. Sometimes I'll journal around this time um, if I feel compelled to. I'm sure those of you who journal, you know some days you really want to journal and you feel like it like, flows out of you and some days you feel like you have nothing to say. but. I'll either journal or I'll play with her, but she'll usually be on the couch with me and hang out a little bit. Usually after this time, she's a little bit tired because she's ran around with Coco and um, she's played with me, but we'll play for a little if anything. I then curl my hair and I do have the sash for her that she actually really enjoys. Um, I'll keep her in the sash. Sometimes I'll let her run around, but again, it's just really hard with her going potty. But whenever we go anywhere, if I bring her in the sash, she's very calm, I've noticed, versus if I just hold her in my hand. I got it off of Amazon, and I'm just curling my hair with this. It's my favorite curling iron. I got it from Ulta. I'll link it down below for you guys. So you just saw I got ready, did my hair and makeup to head out to breakfast. I'm actually meeting my mom and dad, me, my mom and dad, and me are going to go to a Greek restaurant. There is this Greek restaurant in Beverly Hills that I'm obsessed with. It's one that I go to a ton, and we're going to go there for breakfast lunch kind of lunch and for shoes okay, so i showed you guys how i got a ton of just fab shoes and i'm thinking about which ones i want to wear today i think i'm thinking of the snakeskin ones if you haven't seen my last video basically just fab is a website they have shoes bags other accessories things like that i mostly love them for their shoes 
Um, but basically, you can buy their shoes normally, just like you would shop on any website for the regular price, or you can sign up as a VIB, and then you take this kind of like style quiz, and every month you log on, and you have a showroom of like different things that are supposed to fit your style. For example, like these were in my showroom, and these are definitely my style. Super cool, they're strappy, they're snakeskin. And then you can get 40% off the shoes when you're a VIB. And let's say you, you log on, you don't see any shoes you like, even outside of your showroom. You don't have to just buy it from your showroom. You can, the showroom is just to kind of curate some cool things that they think you'd like, but you can buy, um, you can pick out something with your VIB credit elsewhere on the site for the credit. And if you don't like anything that month, you can just skip the month and then you won't be charged. So it's really, really cool. I've talked about it a ton. I always um, mention it whenever I'm wearing just fab. I'll have a link down below. Right now they have this offer until the, I think for the next week or two, where I think you can get your first pair for $10. So if you've never tried just fab and you're just like curious about the quality, what it's like, I highly recommend you try it out now. For example, like you can see right now, just even these shoes are such good quality. They're so beautiful. I'm thinking about wearing these or I just got back from a trip so I wasn't able to wear them after I hauled them or these cheetah ones I really love these are kind of like a suede material and they have cheetah so so cute um, or I even have these cool taupe ones these are taupe and they have kind of like brass detailing I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the snakeskin. I'm wearing these like light wash jeans and a graphic tee. I feel like the snakeskin would be really cool. Restaurant. These are zucchini chips. They're so good. So good, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. It's unbelievable. Do you, you want one piece of bread? You want bread? Here, you can have a piece of bread. You can have. Are you sure it's one of those? Okay, I'm a fitness instructor who, I'm not, he was a little chunky, which is fine. We live your life. And he taught this bar class that my mom goes to. And then he was gone for a month and then he had a substitute. And then he comes back, like you can even recognize it, like, suit, like he's got like lipo basically. Like a ton of like, yeah, like a ton of liposuction. And it's funny because he's like trying to be like a fitness instructor, which is kind of like a low key scam. <laughs> because like, you're trying to be like, oh, work out with me, you'll lose weight, but you've got liposuction. That's such a scam, don't you think? It's one thing to like, I don't know. Oh, what is that? Mm -hmm. You need more bread? Yeah. But people who hire him now are going to be like, wow, he's so fit. Like, little did they know. You should have gone that guy, but that's not in a mean way, but. See, even he knew that that bar class didn't do shit. That's why I stopped taking it. Lighting in here always makes a weird shadow on my face. The only way it doesn't is if I hold it like this. Um, but I am back from lunch and I wanted to wrap up this video. But yeah, basically the last thing we were chatting about we're just fab. I talk about just fab so much, but I highly suggest you guys check it out. It's such an amazing deal. The shoes are always on trend and just amazing quality and such a cool membership to always kind of be on point and have like new cool trends and for such a great price. Like I was saying, I joined as a VIB um, or VIP, sorry, and my mom joined as a VIP too and she loves it and she's always rocking shoes from there. Like she was saying, they're just like cool to have a fun, trendy, um, piece all the time like every month you lo you log on and you can get a new pair of shoes it's kind of exciting and it, and then you don't feel bad if you're not spending um you're not even spending a hundred dollars actually i feel like i want to say every shoe i've seen under there especially when you're the vip with the 40 percent off is always under a hundred dollars so you're getting a new brand new pair of shoes why do i why do i why do i play with my hair so much oh yeah these are the ones that i'm currently obsessed with i feel like you guys need to get these they're so cute i wore them today on a like a long walk probably for like two hours and i was completely fine i really like them i found them really comfy i love them the quality of these is unbelievable like i said i think that they have that deal i'm a seven by the way where you can get your first pair for ten dollars which is unbelievable these with like blue jeans a white blouse would be so cute Honestly, these are just such a fun pair to style. I showed you from before. I'm so excited I'm back from my trip so I can wear all of these. I was so excited to wear all of them. I, I, knew I only brought one pair with me on the trip. I'm so excited to wear these pearl ones. These are so beautiful. I mean, let's just say hi. Uh, but I love these, these ones so much. I honestly could have worn these today. They would have been really cool too. I feel like, like a, uh, a big black oversized... Um, hoodie with kind of like boyfriend jeans and these would be such a good look and like a little uh small bag like 
what's that what's the name of the bag you like hold it like this <laughs> like a small little bag It'd be so cute get those whenever i get stuff i usually get a few pairs because they're such a, such such a good deal so it's easy for me to justify and then i love showing you guys because you guys tell me love them and these these ones These gold ones are perfect for when it's going to get summer. I'm going to bring them on vacation. I literally forgot to bring these to Mexico, and that's what I got them for. They're the cutest little slides. They look so nice, and they look super luxurious, especially with white toenails. They're super flattering. They look so nice. Like, the little bar looks really good. Oh, I love these so much. So I need to bring these with me. That's what I got them for. But also, they'll be good just as, like, a kind of like a casual shoe for wearing leggings, a t-shirt, and then these... And then I showed you these boots. These boots I'm saving for when we go to Mammoth are big or something like that. They're like definitely like more of a wintry shoe. I wish I could show you them. Can you get off? Can you show them? Okay, I'm gonna move her lightly, <laughs> guys. But this is what these look like. I showed you these before. So again, I would definitely take advantage of the deal if it's still going on um, to get the first pair of shoes for $10. It's unbelievable. I basically have told all my friends to sign up for it too. And I hope you guys enjoyed this morning routine of what my mornings are like with a teacup palm. Also, I wanted to say thank you for all your comments and suggestions on how you guys train your dogs. It's been really, really helpful. Again, I'm by no means I'm saying I'm doing everything right, nor do I know anything. So tell you hearing your stories in different ways you guys train your dogs and got them to be well behaved and healthy and happy is awesome so if you have any other tips let me know we are on a schedule for her for breakfast lunch and dinner and now pretty uh, on a good night routine where basically i'll make her help have her fall asleep in my arms and then put her to bed and then usually twice a night she'll whimper to go potty and after each time again i'll let her fall asleep in my arms and i'll put her back in the crate so that she's not crying and then usually when she's good in the morning, I'll let her sleep in the bed for like 30 minutes. But I'm pretty much awake during that time. So yeah, she's been really, really good. She's going to get her second round of shots next week. And then her third round, I believe, a few weeks after that. And then finally she'll be able to go for walks. But again, thank you for all your love up for, towards her. Again, if you want to see more of her and more styling and any of these shoes probably styled, I would follow me on Instagram, subscribe, and I will see you on Thursday or Sunday, or I always try to post an extra video for you guys on Tuesdays, so I'll see you guys then.